That'll do then. Got about 25 miles of downhill down to Wanaka. Uh, and it's already 5.30, so I need to get a move on. Let's just go with it. It's fine. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. I'm on the hilly section between Fox Glacier and Franz Josef now. Got two more climbs to make. And I just met a couple, uh, Nick and Jan. They'd driven out all the way from uh, Christchurch to see me, which is quite good fun. Uh, and they're staying in, they're staying in uh, Franz Josef tonight. And they said when I get there, they're gonna spot me some food. So, Nick and Jan have just spotted me uh, roast pork in uh, Franz Joseph. Thank you very much. Hi. Nick came out with a can of beans. And he was just telling me a story of what he was going to do with his can of beans. Would you mind? Well, I had this big long rope. And I was going to tie it to the beans and sort yeah. of put it just on the side of the road so you come along and see it with this long rope trailing along, either to the car or to a bush. And yeah. it sort of being just sort of semi out of sight. So anyway, it didn't quite work, but yeah. the idea was there. Well, we're going to pull up on the outside. All right, there's absolutely no way this is in focus, but I'm here at a hotel in Franz Josef. I'm not staying at the hotel, but um, Jan and Nick, they are. Um, and I asked at the reception if I could camp just outside. So I'm going to camp in this little section of grass. Best part is, I've got Wi-Fi, so I'm gonna have Wi-Fi on my tent. <laughs> so great to meet you, Ed. We've just loved meeting you and having lots of fun and going out for dinner. Yep, excellent. Yeah. And we travelled a long way to come and see you, but we really enjoyed it. And yeah, it's well nice. worth it. So, how long will it be in total? How, how much driving will it be to see to see me? It's 204 k's to get here, so it's what 408. No, it's more than that. It's 400 k's, wasn't it? Yeah, 400 k's to get here. So 800 k's in total. Yeah, yeah. How many hours of driving? Uh, about five each way. So <laughs> <laughs> well worth it. Well, well worth it. it. Yeah. It's mad. But thank yeah. you very much. Yeah. And yeah, the meal and breakfast and you know, yeah, everything. Thank Excellent. you. Excellent. Yeah. Maybe someone else will see this video and buy you a meal as well. <laughs> we'll see, won't we? <laughs> see you, Franz Joseph. It was unexpected. Was not expecting to meet uh, to meet Nick and Jan. But lovely all the same. All right, I would tell you where I'm going now, but I don't really know. North, going north. I got fireflies left and right. See that right there? That's a sand fly, and they're quite prevalent in this area of, um, of New Zealand on the west coast. My legs are just peppered with these bites from these sand flies. They're not, yeah, I'd say they're not as bad as mosquitoes, but they're just a little bit irritating and they're really itchy. I'd say they're a lot more itchy than mosquitoes, but the actual bites hurt less, I guess. I don't know. But I've been pretty bad and I keep itching them. On my eternal search for the world's best campsite, uh, I find myself in a dry riverbed. I'm not going to camp at the bottom of the beds, but I'm going to try and get up to one of the banks. Uh, it's not going to be easy. Hi. 
right about now you might be thinking to yourself, what was the point of that, Ed? Uh, let me show you. Now, could I have camped in a campsite tonight? Yep. Could I have camped by the side of the road? Absolutely. So why then would I come all the way out here to pitch my tent? I'm going to let this view answer that question. Just, just casual, bras on the fence. Why not, eh? Why not? Pink bra, blue bra, moldy bra, bra, half a bra, tattered bra, 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 bra. Want to see something terrifying? First bras, now uh, I don't even know. I don't even know what that is. I'm very aware that that sign says that the road's closed and I probably shouldn't be going this way. I'm gonna try it. Um, I'm a bit sick of these big roads. I've hit, so I'm on the, the State Highway 6 or something, and all the traffic from the State Highway 1 going the length of the country has come to this road because of uh, road closure on the State Highway 1 because of the earthquake last year. Um, and that road is still not, you know, you can't, it's still a no through road, so people are going around, and this is the detour road. Uh, so ordinarily it wouldn't be so busy, but it's super busy at the moment and I'm a bit sick of it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go this way. Um, it's potentially a bit of a mistake because it's 25 miles uh, until I can rejoin the road again. But I want a little bit of adventure because I've been mainly on big roads, so I want, I want some excitement. And I want to see what's down this way. And I just want to get away from cars, man, <laughs> and lorries. So we're going to try this. Oh, God, I'm just, oh, these sand flies, man. I, I can't deal with it. Oh. <laughs> I thought they weren't, I thought they weren't too bad, but they are, they're, they're actually quite painful. Uh, so I've got a problem with the bike. Um, one of these straps has come loose. I, 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 can't, I can't explain it very well, but basically if when I'm walking or riding the bike, um, the wheel is rubbing on the bag. worked out why this is rubbing um, it's because these bolts have come loose I took the front bag off that's where the front bag fits just here um, and some stuff dropped into the grass oh no oh, damn god damn get out of my face oh, there's one there's one I found I found one <laughs> ah get off me you can just take the day off dudes just take the day off ah! I give up. We got one. We got one. I'm not flying the other one. Ooh -wee, we gonna fly down into the easy chair. Update then. The track I was trying to go on last night, I was actually kicked off that this morning. Um, which is possibly fair enough. The owner of that field, that, that track, uh, he said, just go away, basically. And I probably should have asked, because I probably shouldn't have... Uh, Jumped over that fence to go that way. Uh, I'm now back on the big road. How's it going? Can't, can't have you going through our sights on there. When you come up through here. I can't get you going through on this. Yeah, it's too dangerous. On a bicycle. So, well, it's just, it's really dangerous. Can I walk through? I'll just take you through. No, I can't do that. Why can't you do that? Because uh, I've been riding around the world on a unicycle for two and a half years. And if I'm on land, I have to ride. That's the rule. It's just for safety reasons. This, this is your manager, is it? Yeah, it's one. Hiya, how's it going? How are you? I'm good, yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, I'm worried about your safety. I understand, <laughs> I understand. Yeah. So are you okay with these guys? I'm not. Um, I'm all right not to ride. I can walk the section. A long, it's a long section. How yeah. far is the section? It's probably, there's, there's a couple of sections there of three or four K each. It's yeah. bloody dangerous, okay? Yeah. And, and I feel much, why are you opposed to us picking you up and carting us Because I, I've been riding this thing around the world for two and a half years. Yeah. And the rule is if I'm on land, I have to ride or be under my own power. Yeah. I cannot get in someone's car. But it's been two and a half years. Oh, you could potentially get killed up there or cause a serious accident. That's I understand. What, that's why I'm taking this action. Yeah, yeah, I understand. You know? And, and we're um, responsible for people's safety through yeah, our work sites. I understand. Um, but would, would an option be me to walk by the side of the no, road? No, it won't, because we've picked hitchhikers up and taken them through as well. It's a narrow road, It's there's no shoulder or anything, and there's blind corners in it. Okay, well, then and, we're stuck then. No, you're not stuck. I think you, you you can get your, if you need to get a dispensation or something, you know. I can't if do you're that. Dead, if you're dead, you haven't made it, then have you? I think I've just seen some wild pigs. I'm gonna get the longer lens on. Wow. <laughs> Scared those guys. 